All right, I feel like I'm good to go now. Um, I appreciate the follow. I kind of wish you had done that so the fancy sound effect could have gone. Um, I mean, it did, but you just didn't see the nice little pop-up that came with it. But uh, welcome to the stream, my dudes. Today, we are going to continue playing My Time at Portia, as voted on by Twitter. Um, you can see I've got a little shack. And we've got some quests to do on the side. Um, it's a whole lot of stuff. I'm, I'm ready. I'm excited. I'm good to go. And let me know if I'm too loud or if the game is too loud or if there's anything that I can adjust. Um, it OBS does kind of show me that my levels are a little high, so I'm a little worried. I'm blowing your eardrums out. <laughs> so much work just to play video games for the internet. Just a little bit. Just a, just a touch. There we go. Just gonna give the game a moment to get situated. Oh shit. What's this? I got another pair of gloves. Nice. Now I can punch things. Uh, let's check our mail. Okay, we got a silver furnace. That's good. I'm f feeling we're going to need that for something. Um, look at this tiny ass yard we have. Oh, and the boards were finished from last time. But really, look at this tiny fucking yard. <sighs> One day it will grow. One day when we have um, 15,000, or not 15,000, what the fuck did that say? 1,500. There we go. I know how to math. Um, what were we making? I completely forget. Ah, planter boxes. I needed to collect feces. I named an achievement called Vomit. I'll learn about what that is later, I guess. Kinda don't want to know with an achievement called Vomit. Boo. And I'm glad I'm fine for you. Um, I uh, I also know my keyboard can kind of be annoying, so if that gets to be too much as well, let me know, and I'll switch to a controller. So running back and forth. This game is a lot of running and waiting and running and waiting and running and waiting and crafting and waiting and running and waiting and collecting. But you only have so much stamina, and once you run out, that's it. You're done. Uh, shit, dog. Wait. Somebody wants something from me. Hello. What do you want? Umbrellas Good are important. You. Oh. I've got a problem here. You see, hey, CJ. folks have been buying up a lot of umbrellas, and now I'm short on stock. <laughs> I'm gonna try to make some, but, well, I need materials. What type of materials? I might have to turn down the voice acting Nothing a bit for me. World. I forgot how Just loud I made it. from the sea urchins you see lazying around the town. Thinking, great. Sure. Remember though. Yeah, no, we're gonna we're gonna change that right now. That's oh, that's right in my ears. Sound, voice over. Yeah, that was turned all the way up. Maybe that wasn't my smartest plan. Um, let's go finish this planter box quest. See what we need to do for the water tank so we can get those out of the way. Um, this is Emily. This is one of the waifus. She doesn't like that. I almost ran into her. Uh, this is Nora. She's also a waifu. I don't know if Lee is a waifu or a husbando. Actually, let's find out. Because in social, it'll tell me who I can seduce. So Lee is not, not a husbando. You can see who the husbandos are because they have hearts beside their name. People you can't have romance with have stars next to their name. So I, I could, I don't want to, no, I don't want to sleep this Django. I'm good. I'm leaning towards Emily or possibly Albert or Gust or Arlo. There's just, there's so many choices. There's too many for me. All I know is I'm not, no Sonia. <laughs> I don't think I could wake up every day and listen to her voice. Let me see if I can find her. There she is. I, uh. 
I appreciate all voice acting of all calibers, but I just, I don't enjoy the Valley Girl California kind of. Like, oh my god, like totally look at me. Like, aren't I like so totally pretty? Not particularly a fan of that. The beverages here are all brewed by the brewmaster Django himself. Try them all. I see what they were going for, but uh, no thank you, not for me. I will leave them to, to I will leave Sonia to do her thing. Phyllis on the other hand, Phyllis on the other hand, is prime waifu material. She ha also has a nice kind of low voice, which I kind of really dig. Sorry, I was in that zone. If you have an ailment, please come to the clinic. Don't worry, Phyllis. I'll be I'm making frequent visits to the to the clinic, mostly because I hurt myself. But you know, that's beside the point. Oh my goodness. Thank you, BB Wolf, for hosting me. I appreciate it a lot. Do do do. I think I'm almost done with this planter box quest. I think this was the last one I had to do. Um, and then I had to make water tanks, which require wooden boards, which means I need this cutter to cut more wood, which means I need to cut more wood. I'll figure it out eventually. I also need stone bricks. Um, where's my furnace? Do I have any stone bricks? I don't have any stone bricks on me. I'm gonna put that there, and I'll put that there. And uh, you also have to pay for inventory space, which I'm not quite a big fan of, but I understand the mechanic of it. But I uh, just let me have my full bag. That's the only thing I've noticed with a lot of farming games or collecting games, other than Minecraft, is that you always have to unlock more inventory space which just, I don't know, it doesn't make much sense to me. Just give me my inventory. Um, ah, yes, we're going to talk to, I think, Emily. She's the one who wanted the planter boxes. I think she is in here right now. Oh, Thank wow, you. she's right there. I can't wait to try these out. Cool. Got money. I think I can unlock inventory right now. Uh, and do that right away. And then I still need to build the bridge head and the bridge body, which is going to take a bit of time. So I hope you enjoy me just running around building shit, collecting shit, building more shit. God, it takes a lot of wood to make a wooden board. And let it begin. My quest to deforest Portia. Starts with all these little trees. Soon we'll get to the big trees. Not just the trees, but the women trees. And the children trees too. Is this what Brit meant when she said I should like save all my free time to deforest Portia? Do, do. Got any wood, kid? Yeah. Eventually we can get it so people just deliver us wood. So we don't have to go and deforest the lands. Uh, eventually when we get to the tree farm. Which I'm excited for. The tree farm has, I'm pretty sure his name is Arturo. But I don't quite remember. Hacking and whacking and slashing. This game is just so aesthetically pleasing. I know I say that every time I play it, but... It's just very pretty. A lot of love went into this game, and... 
You can really, like, you can tell. You can big time tell. Oh, here's another husbando. Just give me a second, I gotta run there. Do do do. This is Remington. Also, the prime choice for husbandos. If you see anything suspicious, just tell me. Only thing I'm not a fan of is how jarring the difference in the audio quality is between characters. It's great that online voice actors were used. Not a fan of the fact that the creators didn't choose to go with an almost uniform kind of sound. But that could just be me being nitpicky. Put a lot of stock into how certain things sound and how games sound and for a character to just have drastically different audio quality compared to everybody else. It almost pulls me out of the game. And uh, I had to be like, oh, my immersion, but <laughs> kind of ruins it for me. Do, do, do. Take that. Craft more of those. Oh, and then we have to fuel this, which takes wood. Everything takes wood or some modicum of power. But I feel like no matter what, wood is going to be necessary. Wood and stone. Move that there. Move that there. So that's what mostly we're going to be doing. Is deforesting Portia and de de-stoning it? Would that be the right term? Four score and seven stone a go. See... That's my thing as well. And it's like, it's great that you're using voice actors who are trying to make their break and not like trying to find big names or whatever it is, or you don't have the <laughs> quarrying. Yes, thank you. That's the word. Um, or you don't wanna, like you don't have the budget to hire big name voice actors or whatever it is that leads you to find the, find an online voice actor. But at the same time, you need to understand that there has to be a sort of uniformity to it. And it feels like I, you can tell a lot of love went into this game. A lot of love went into the look of it. And I think just as much love should go into the sound of it as well. And I guess that's just kind of what I'm lacking. I guess that's my biggest pet peeve. But at the same time, you can't, I'm not going to be like, you need to recast every single voice in this game. Because that's not fair to the voice actors who were cast. Because they earned their spot in this game. The game developer... The game developer saw them and decided, you, you're perfect for this character. And I'm just some person on the internet. I'm just playing the game. Uh, I don't have any power stones. Looks like we're going to have to go back into... We got one. We're gonna have to go back into the mines, folks. Let's check the mail. 19th of the month, the day of the bright sun, we sincerely invite you to prepare a present for the town and give it to Mayor Gale before the 18th. On the day of the holiday, we will throw the presents from our airship like always. Thank you. But yes, I, I also agree. Standardizing the recording equipment is very important. Especially if you want your game to do well. I guess that's also why I wasn't really a fan of Dream Daddy. But that could also be from binging the game and then going back and trying to replay it. It, uh, it missed its mark with me. Oh, shoot. Why do I have to go in here? I don't quite recall. Or do I have to talk to you? What? Oh, I have to, okay. I now understand what happened. I have to give him a gift for the day of the bright sun and I just don't have one. We'll figure that out later. I, I have plenty of time. It's on the 19th, it's the 12th, Never mind. We'll figure it out after. Let's go into the, the mines. Oh, I'm so glad I had the money for that. I didn't think I did.
That's one thing I screwed up on my last game where I um, upgraded my inventory as much as I could, but then 100% forgot to also um, make sure I had enough money to go down into the mines. And I'm here looking for power stones, which can be found using the power goggles, which have currently frozen on me. So I'm just gonna... Yep, there it goes. When I play this game on my own, I don't have half as much issues as I have when I'm trying to stream it. Copper. Here I go again down this hole. I got a weird jar glass piece. I'm not too worried about the artifacts. I don't honestly believe they're necessary to me right now. The museum's not open. I'm not gonna have any use for them until that happens and that doesn't happen for a long ass time. At least it didn't happen for a long ass time in my uh in my like private my personal game. Doot. Now I got the same weird glass jar piece. Uh, oh, right there. Oh, I did it again. Sometimes my mouse will also click off of this game and I'm just like, why? Why? That data disc and the thinking can piece. I'm probably gonna sell all these. I can always come back and find more of them later. Got a small clock. Oh, I can put that in my house. When we go back, we can put that in my house. Right now, the goal is power stones. Without power stones, our equipment can't run, and we kinda need our equipment run if we're gonna be doing literally anything. You feel me? A power stone and they don't when you're in the mines they don't usually come in just one they'll come in multiples which is also nice so now it's not too much of a drag to try and get things that power your equipment because th this is the only way you can get them I haven't found any other way so far in game to get power stones other than either mining them or completing commissions Do do data discs are also important. If it's not too late, um, and I, I when I ran out of stamina, if it's not too late, we're gonna go and hit up um, the what's it called, the research center, and give them some data discs. Let's see, is there anything around? Nope. It's kind of in this little divot. Ah, oh, there we go. Found one. Do, do, do. It is. It's a really interesting take on mining where you get the... You get a bunch of stone, you get a bunch of sand, you get about just stuff you do need. But then you can also find artifacts and data disks and other stuff to help you progress throughout the game. It's a bit of a... We're putting the mining back in Minecraft as it goes. Oh dear, it appears somebody has tagged me in something on Facebook. No thank you, I will deal with that later. Not my problem, it's future Catherine's problem. I don't have enough space in my inventory. Oh, uh, we can get rid of a pair of these gloves. Do I just have... Oh. I just have two wooden bridge heads. That's fine. Do I still not have enough room in my inventory for whatever it is? 
Or is my game just glitching? It looks like the game is just glitching out, so whatever is there, I can't get anymore. Oh well. Shit happens. Oh my god, there we go. Mechanics of it too, the way it just kind of scopes it out. I imagine it's kind of easy to get a bit lost. Yeah! Uh, getting lost in tunnels is something I do a whole lot. A whole lot of. You also find some weird shit down here. And uh, apparently I discovered something that means I need a better pickaxe. I don't know what that is. Oh. Oh dear. So I can't deal with whatever that is right now. And either way, my inventory is kind of full. So we are going to go out of here. <laughs> oh my god. There's an easier way to do this. I forget that you can fast travel sometimes. Not everywhere, just kind of out of the mines. You can fast travel elsewhere in the game after the fact. Let's see. I still don't have anything to give Gale as a gift, so that bright shining star is gonna throw me off. Maybe I'll just buy something. I don't know. Maybe I'll make something. What do I have that I can make? Actually, I almost forgot to do what I said I was gonna do, and that was go to the research center. Good job, me. No, ignore him. We've got better things to do than talk with the mayor right now. Um, this is another waifu. This is May. She's a reporter. She's got a poncho and a snazzy hat. Uh, and no, I haven't seen the mystery man. I am mildly upset the game won't let me seduce the mystery man. But only mildly, because you never actually see what's behind his mask. And I feel like that might, uh, that might cause some tension in the quote-unquote relationship if I was never to be able to see my love's face. It would be like Eros and Psych. I probably butchered both of those Greek mythology names. Research. Hi. Did you discover something new? Yeah. Um. I don't Data do that. corruption on these discs are minimal. There should be useful info on them. We'll have something for you by tomorrow. You could hear her inhale on that one line, too. There's nothing bad with her acting, though. Her acting is fine. Her acting's quite good. The fact that you can hear that intake of breath. Thank you. I appreciate it. I, um... I think out of all the mythologies I studied in high school, or that we went over in world religion, I think Greek mythology is my favorite and will always be my favorite. Alright, we're gonna sell some shit. Bye. Bye. Um. Get rid of that too. And I think that's all I can sell to her because I want to hold on to some of this stuff for later. Not everybody will buy everything, so you kind of have to be careful. I have two bridge heads, so I just need the bridge body, and I don't quite remember what I need for that. But we'll figure it out later. Refuel this. Refuel this. Cut more of those. Because I need to do another water tank. But I need five stone brick and... I can just check the book. I don't know why I keep trying to do it the hard way. Yeah, I need five stone brick and four wooden boards. Oh, I have, en I have enough wooden boards. I just don't have enough wooden brick. Wooden brick. Stone brick. Good job, brain. I'm glad we're on the same page today. Psyche is two syllables. Psyche. I, you know what? Nah. Not gonna say Psyche. That, sad, like, I understand it's probably where calling it your Psyche comes from, but I think I, I prefer Psyche. Because, you know, it's a joke. You know, like, Psyche, gotcha. 
She tries to stab Eros. Psych. That was dumb. I'm so sorry. It was a very dumb joke on my part. I used to pronounce Athena. Or I used to pronounce it as Athena instead of Athena. And apparently the proper way to say it is Athena instead of Athena. Which I don't quite get because it's not two E's. It's one E. And it's T-H-E-N. So, then. But I digress. It's not English. It is Greek. And it's all Greek to me. Wink. Alright, let's go give this commerce commission to this dude and get paid. Hello, Antoine, my beautiful little twink. Here's your commerce commission. You got paid $700 and there's no commissions on the board. God damn it. It's also the weekend. There will be no commissions on the weekend. Why do I always do this to myself? Why do I always bamboozle myself? But uh, this way I can actually see what it takes to build the bridge body. Oh, and I have more quests even. That, um, social handy book. That's what I want. Where is it that tells me about the bridge body? There it is. What do I need? Bronze plate. Alright. Gotta go make some bronze. Cause I don't think I have enough bronze on me to make enough plates. Do, 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 do. Take that. I will take that. Um, I have enough to make two. How many did I need? Handy book, there it is. I needed five, so I'm gonna need more bronze, so when that's done, I can get, I can get going on that. But until then, we're gonna go punch, um, ooh, my voice cracked a little bit there. We're gonna go punch some spiny urchins until they give us their spines. Whoop. Ooh, that's the other thing I forgot I could do. I have skill points. Um, stamina. Stamina, stamina. Apply. Gain some fur, that's cool. It's not really what I'm looking for right now. We're looking for floating urchins. Look like sea urchins, except with balloons. Or not balloons, little umbrellas. Look. There they are. And how many do I need? I need 20 spines. Here we go. Hello. Uh, my frames are dropping. Game, please. I want to work with you, not against you. I guess that's kind of the other thing that bugs me, that it gives me so much meat, but it only gives me one spine when I kill them. And their bodies are literally covered in spines. But okay, I'll only get one. Just small little grapes. But again, the game. Absolutely gorgeous. Meaningful plot. This is just me being nitpicky as fuck. The mechanics of heading are also pretty cool. Because you just beat the shit out of things. I like using the gloves, though. Um, I have a sword as well. Or I can make one at least. Hey, get back here. This fucker was trying to fly away. Nah. -uh. Where are you going? You're here for a fucking smackdown, dude. There's no running. You can't hide. I mean, you can run, but you can't hide. 
Let's see if I can find any more. I don't want to. I don't want to beat the snail, Bob. He's okay. He hasn't done anything wrong just yet. He's got some fucking crazy eyes, though. I don't see any more. If I turn around, will more be there? Will they just respawn after I've walked away far enough? Because I only have seven, and I need twenty. Look, he thought he was hiding from me. He thought he could escape. Let's teach this motherfucker a lesson. Goodbye, Mr. Zeergen. More used to spawn around here-ish, unless I'm just imagining things. But it could also be because I killed too many of them. I'll come back, uh, I'll come back later. See if any, any new ones have arrived. There's the mare chasing after the bus for some reason. There's the bus stop to Portia. I could probably put one of the bodies down for this. I won't be able to do the other one until I get the bridgehead taken care of. Did I sell? Oh no, I didn't. I was about to be real pissed off at myself. I'm like, did I sell the things I needed? Would I really be that dumb? The answer is yes. I honestly would be that dumb. Put that bad boy down. Yeah, see, it won't let me put that bad boy down because it has to go on the other side. So until I get the bridge body done, I can't really do anything. I'm kind of shit out of luck. No, ignore the mare. Keep going. Also, this nice shadow outline of a thing is where I can place a trap to eventually get one of those llamas as my own to ride around as a horse. Isn't it great? Um, here we go. Fuel depleted. I'm gonna cancel that and then I'm gonna craft. I'm gonna refuel, I'm gonna recraft, and then I'm gonna go chop some more trees down. Actually, I should put this away. Did I? I did make a storage chest. Good job, me thinking ahead, sorta. I can put some stuff in there. Just not everything. Take that out, and I'll take the sand and the brick and that stuff out so I can actually fit, like, the seeds and the feathers and the, um... Just the other kind of nonsensical shit. I'll make more storage later. I'll go put these down in my house. Unfortunately, having multiple of these doesn't double, doesn't like double up on my max health. It won't add 28 max health. It'll only add 14. But I... I know, um, I don't think you have too many clocks around. You'll always need to tell time at some point. Might be when you're laying down in bed and you won't want to get up. Deforced in Portia. For the good of the people. You have no health left. Why didn't you just fall? There we go. Takes care of that. Here's some more small trees I can chop down. I don't know if Max is good enough to do the big trees yet. Well, you never know until you try. Hey, here we go. It's gonna take a while, but I can actually cut down these big fuckers. And then you can get rid of the stumps as well. 
I got some extra stuff. I got some resin and I got some rubber fruit. I don't know why I stumbled over saying rubber fruit. Fruit that is made from rubber. And you're done. Um, there's not much else I can do today. I can't make the copper blades yet. Mostly because I don't have any copper. Once the bronze bars are done, I'll cook some copper so I can get that out of the way. I should probably make a gift. Yeah, I'll make a talisman. I'll make that my gift. Let's go find the mare. Last time I checked, he was over here fishing. Do, do, do. Hello, Russo. Oh, I'm going to show you guys another thing while I'm here. Up. All of these guys, every single one of these fuckers, all of them are seducible. They each have kind of unique-ish personalities despite their similar appearances. And you can pick one of them as your husbando. Not me, though. They're not particularly my type. Nope. Hello, Mr. Mayor, sir. My son Gus is nothing like me. Well, except for his talent and good-looking oh, face. So he's everything like you, Mr. Mayor. How humble of you. You need that. Not bad. Looks like you put some thought into it. Yeah, I did. I'm sure the celebrations for the Day of the Bright Sun are a bit different in Barnardock. Here, the airship tradition has been going on for almost 40 years. I think it started when someone uh, jumped on a <laughs> statue and started throwing cranberry candy at everyone. Yeah. So the festival that he's talking about is actually kind of really cool. You have to like run around and fight against the townsfolk to get a present. And sometimes it's um, it's kind of silly stuff. It's kind of like, I think I got a bouquet last time and then I got cooking. Uh, I got a rock once. I don't know who put a rock in there. Not a fan. Got more bronze bars. I'm gonna refuel this before I go to bed. And then we're gonna go to Betty Bye. We're gonna rest our little head. Another game mechanic for farming simulator games that I'm getting real sick and tired of is not having a goddamn save function for outside of sleeping. Like, fuck that. I don't wanna have to play through a whole day like i might have to go somewhere i might have to go to work my character's not gonna i don't want to put my character to sleep in the like in the middle of the day i should probably manage my time better in real life but like still let's build this i'm gonna need a lot more stone brick as well but i think i have it yeah i do Accidentally just have enough stone brick on me and then I just need the bronze plates I think I have two right now so I can at least start that Put those there and then I need the two for here. I love how it calls for bronze plates, but it just it looks like wood Thank you game for making me do all this work for very very little reward How many? I need three so that means I need six more bronze bars and I only have two. How many are going there? Six are going in there. That should be good. Let's go. Today's Sunday so there won't be any commerce commissions. Let's go cut down some more trees. Ooh, or better yet, we're gonna go punch some urchins. I still need to get 20, 20 spines and I only have eight. I really need to get that copper blade commission done now. I think that's a time sensitive one. Mission. Oh no, that one's not a time sensitive one. None of these are time sensitive. What am I thinking? You will run into missions that are time sensitive. Most of the commerce commissions that you choose to take on will be time sensitive. And a handful of... Um... 
a handful of the quests the villagers will give out to you will also be time sensitive. Can I hop on the back of this? Hey, I can. I didn't realize I could get on this. Is he gonna... I just need him to take me over that way more. Just go a little more forward. I'm not, sir, I am not getting off at this stop. Sir? Ugh, oh, fine. Whatever. Here we go. More spiny urchins. Come here. Oh my god, stop running away. Mm. There we go. I need these fuckers to stop running away from me when I'm trying to beat the shit out of them. You know how unfair it is to me for them to just leave when I'm trying to punch them? Be more considerate. Do I have half the amount of spines I need? Come here. I'm a punch of your bones. I'm a punch of your bones. I'm a buff baby that can dance like a man. I can shake up my fanny. I can shake up my can. I need to catch up on Adventure Time. I need to go back and rewatch everything. I fell off some point around season four and I just, I couldn't get back into it. Now I see a bunch of shit happened and Finn lost his arm and I just, I'm exasperated. How could this fun loving children's cartoon of frivolity turn into something so intense and deal with things such as amputation? Greek is a lot more simplistic with its rules, but they frequently don't match up with the rules of English. For example, Chiron starts with a K sound. That's fair. I don't know any English rules where the CH makes the K sound. Oh wait, yes I do. Character. That's CH, right? Yeah, character. I don't think I've ever seen it with an I, though. I'm trying to think of words I know. You stopped sometime at the beginning of season five. What happened in season five? I don't even remember. I don't even remember what happened in season four, to be honest. All I know is Marceline's great. Finn has a crush on PB. That doesn't go well. He tries to get over it. PB's like, the fuck? Why? And uh, Finn's like, um, cuz you're older than me and you're clearly not interested in me? What are you doing? Flame Princess is really cute. Marcy is best character, yes. Marceline is in fact the best character. I 100% agree. I also subscribe to the canon that every now and again she drinks PB's blood, which is why sometimes PB has a wears like a choker and she seems a little bit less pink than usual because Marceline is drinking the red from her. But that's just me. That's just my fun little head canon. Unless it's been confirmed and I just don't know about it yet. Marceline also has all the best songs, in my opinion. Except for the one where Finn finally breaks down and sings his feelings about Princess Bubblegum. Because I find myself just kind of humming that all the time. Just, what am I to you? Am I a joke, your knight, or your brother? What am I to you? Do you look down on me because I'm younger? It's really good. And then Marceline's song about her feelings where she's like, she just belts out that she thinks Princess Bubblegum looks down on her and PB's like, what? No? When did that happen? And it turns out, um, the door, the door lord, which was a very interesting play on the Doctor Who archetype.
I, it makes me sad too. But she deserved better, I think. I'm just your problem. Yes, that's the one. I'm just your problem is a really good one. And there's just, there's so much history between Marceline and PB that doesn't get fully explored in this, in like where I am in the show. And I'm just like, I just, what went, what went wrong? What happened to you two? Why are you no longer friends? I need to know. Oh my God. What the fuck? Everybody coming home from church? Okay. I don't know what happened there. That's a lot of people coming from the same location. Um, I don't think there's fall damage in this game. Do you want to find out? Whee! And there isn't. Thank God for no fall damage, because I would have died. I wonder what the rating is on this game. It's PG-13 and I'm dropping F-bombs. I'm like, oh no, I'm sorry. One day these blades, these bronze bars will be done. I honestly think I need to build a better furnace, but I can't do that just yet. So until then, off to sleep we go. Okay, I thought a cutscene was gonna start for some reason. Hello, mail. Research results. I got a cooking set. Nice. As you all know, we currently don't have an active barber shop in town. Ever since Sanwa was mocked for his colorblindness during that haircutting competition by the judges and competitors alike, he's never recovered. Uh, this is my time at Porsche, Jeremy. It's a nice, fun little farming game. It's I like to say it's like, it's Harvest Moon, it's got a little bit of Stardew, it's got a little bit of Minecraft, it's got a little bit of Rune Factory, it's like all those jumbled up together in a nice, refreshing way. Also, hey! I do love Olivia Olson's Mercy singing voice, and Mercy songs are wonderful too, and best of all, she plays bass. I do like her axe bass. It's a practical weapon for slaying hearts and slaying bodies. Um, what was I doing? I'm distracted again. Need one more plate and then I can finish that. And then I need to make more copper bars. Where we fuel. So we gotta come back in an hour. I'm sure we can find things to do in that hour. Bass guitarist says yes. Oh hey Shane, welcome. I didn't see you there. Literally. Uh, I don't know how many people are actually watching this right now, but OBS is telling me to. So thank you to all two of you who are here today. Let's see. It's a water tank. It's wooden storage. I will take the wooden storage. And that's stone brick. Do do do. Eventually, I'm also gonna get a new outfit because as cute as this is, I need to. I need something a little bit different. But we're not gonna worry about that right away because outfits are also kind of level restricted. And I don't want to, I don't want to start anything I can't quite finish just yet. I only just came, then I arrived in chat. Thank you. Twitch says five are watching right now. OBS is lying to me then. It's breaking my heart. Thank you all five of you who are here. I appreciate it. Let's see. Um, once this finishes up, this last bronze plate, I can finish the bridge quest. And then once I get enough copper bars, I can finish the copper blades quest, and then I can work on wooden storages. So for now, we're just gonna keep chopping down trees. You are tearing me apart, OBS. Oh, hi, Shane. The disaster artist 
is the cringiest fucking movie I've ever had the displeasure of watching. And I, uh, and we played a drinking game with it the one day. And we got real, <laughs> we got real sloshed, let me tell you. That was a fucking, that was a riot. That was a fucking good game. I need to learn to not play drinking games and follow every single rule. Because that's how you get fucked. That's how you get fucked real bad. Ooh, I leveled up. Cool. That also means... Have you seen the room? Yes, the room. Why did I call it the Disaster Artist? That's the remake, right? Disaster Artist is the remake with James Franco and somebody else. I just know James Franco. And unpopular opinion, but James Franco is just... Okay. He is just okay. Why did I say disaster artist? My brain don't work so good, dude. He is real tired. But the one thing I am thankful about is work is getting a little less chaotic since we, um... They finally hired another assistant manager, so I won't be take I won't be working like a full five day, six day week, which I'm I'm thankful for because it was starting to get to the point where I was stressing out. And that's honestly where I think my five day migraine came from is just work stress. But now I get to relax and play video games and not ache from my brain to the tips of my toes. <laughs> that emoji is so fucking cute. Here we go. And then I also have a job interview on Monday. So here's hoping that goes well. But that would be a very nice, refreshing change of pace from where I'm at right now. And I love my current job. I really do. I love my current job. I love the people I work with. But it's very... Everybody thinks the place I work at. They always say it's a really cool place. But, uh, that's only because they don't actually work there. <laughs> they don't actually get to see the other side of it where it's not the cool place to work at. Jeremy, I can't wait to do some voice acting for once. What are you voice acting in, Jeremy? Or what have you, um, tried to voice act in? What have you auditioned for? Tell me. I want to know. Go in here. Oh, here he is. Hello. Excellent work. Here's your payment. Thank you, my twink. Um, I already took a come on, come on, come on, come on, commission. A Minecraft roleplay. Minecraft roleplays are interesting. I don't think I would ever make one. We are all voice actors on this blessed day. You are a voice actor. You are a voice actor. Yes, you, on the staff, you are also a voice actor. Congratulations. Let's see. What do I need? I need to make... Hey, four wooden storages. That's exactly what I needed. Cool. Then I need to make copper blades. Which means I need three copper blades, which means I need six pieces of copper. So once that's done, I'm gonna have a roll with these commissions, my dude. A mother fucking roll. Do do do. Ran out of stamina, so now I gotta run slow. Now I gotta go fast. Gotta go fast like Sonic. Like Sonic. Hello, Polly. That's another thing. Not all the lines are voice acted, but most of them are. So it's a little confusing for me. It's a little jarring to go from voice acted to not voice acted. Um, I'm all beyond level five, and I think I'm even. Let me see what level I'm at real quick. Level eleven. So I can afford some new clothes. Level ten. I'll get the casual pants, and I'll get new work shirt get ready boys you're about to see a fashion change boop boop check it 
Look at me. I look super badass now. Wee! Look at my outfit. I look adorable. I wish I could cut my hair this short again. I just don't want to deal with the backlash from chopping it all off. Hi, May. Bye, May. This is also another waifu that I'm highly considering. This is Alice. Flower has its own language. My favorite flower is the bellflower. It speaks of true love. My only gripe with her is, again, the quality of microphone used. It's very different. We'll listen to Remington talk. We're sort of a frontier town. If you go west from here, you'd hit the peripheries in a hurry. Sometimes a weird monster will show up all the way from there. So we have to be careful at all times. Yep, very different compared to Alice. And we'll talk to Sonia. The beverages here are all brewed by the brewmaster Django himself. Sonia. The beverages here are all, are all brewed by the brewmaster Django himself. Try them all. I don't... Her quality is great, but I just cannot stand her voice. That's another reason why I'm husbando hunting. We're hunting for the perfect voice in this whole game. Just something I don't mind listening to for the rest of my days, from day in to day out. Once we find him, we'll be good. We'll be Gucci. <laughs> the voice acting sounds like it's done in a closet. Yeah, it really does, Brit. And not like I do most of my recording in a closet and my my recording does not sound like that. Or at least I hope it doesn't. I would hope somebody would tell me if it does. Like he was in a closet while his mic was on the outside. That may have been editing. That may have just been how he compressed his audio. If he did the editing himself instead of giving just the raw audio to the game devs. Um, but yeah. It also sounded like he was real close to it. That would be like me recording like, Hi guys, welcome to the stream. I'm really close to my microphone. How you doing? Now I'm backing up, and that's a lot better, right? I'm not in your head anymore. Uh, what was I gonna do? I was gonna do something. Let's go punch some llamas. Just kidding. Animal abuse isn't funny. She says as she chuckles. Alright, these... Yeah, I'll open these up. Yay, feathers! Oh my god, eggs! Let's see. I know I can use eggs for something, I just don't know what yet. Uh, I'm gonna pull these out, because I guess I'm just gonna keep planting them until I'm done with them. Damn it, Socks. I just about launched my laptop and I don't mean with my hands. God damn it. They were actually talking through a piece of foam. Why would you punch llamas? You punch llamas so they give you fur, Jeremy. You punch llamas so they give you resources. Let me show you, since I still have enough stamina to do this. Look at this colorful llama. See how he runs from me? Because he knows. We're going to punch the shit out of it. And sometimes even kick it. So he gives me worn fur, meat, and colorful fur, which will be useful later on. And eventually, um, when I'm rich and famous, you punch the literal shit out of llamas. It's true. Every now and again, you get animal feces from killing the llamas. It's a good time. I highly suggest it. I, I do suggest picking up this game. Um, wait, potential husband, come back. No, he's faster than me. He's gonna get away. Gust! No, he's gonna go to bed. I can't interact with him. Nope, he's gone. And this is Albert, another potential husband. Have you ever met Gust's sister? She looks so fair. She doesn't come outside very often. I've only seen her a few times. Not bad. He definitely has the accent going for him. I do have a, a bit of a soft spot for him. Not bad at all. But still, there's something about it that my ears just don't like. And I'm very picky about who I choose to listen to. Except for Justin. And I can say this because Justin's not here because he doesn't watch my streams. 
Justin annoys the ever-loving shit out of me, but I'll still listen to him talk. Um, do, do, do. do I have fertilizer still? I ask myself because you guys wouldn't know if I still have fertilizer. I do. It's fertilizer shit. Boop. Is he happy now? Yeah, he is. I'm sure there's a way for me to make fertilizer. I just haven't figured it out yet. Do, do, do. I can put the feces in there. I think that's it. That's all I'm going to put in there for now. And off to bed we go, my loves. What did Cusco ever do to me? Um, Cusco did nothing wrong. Everything Cusco did was absolutely perfect. Cusco has no flaws. He's the perfect Disney princess. Hello. Here, cutscene. Great news. The, the man secured, secured the funding to make 5 DDs. These are three wheeled transports used for short distance travel. They will make our town much more accessible. Yes. This is a big order. The mayor posted the five orders separately on the Commerce Guild board. You can start working on them immediately. I'm sure the Yeah, thanks Presley. This guy basically tries to get me work whenever he can. Which is, I appreciate. You know. Gotta help a girl out when she's new in town. Do, do, do. Let's see. What does it say? We are happy to inform you that the safety inspection we have... Oh, wow. We're happy to inform you that after safety inspections, we have opened up a new abandoned ruin for diving. It is located atop the hill at the north end of town beyond the Civil Corps building. The Silver... Silver... The... The... The Civil Corps... Core? The civil core? Is the P silent? Somebody tell me. Is the P silent? I need to know. A oh, manner voice. Dee Dee. What do I need to make a Dee Dee stop? Or a Dee Dee transport? Um, small engine, rubber tires. I need to make a skiver. The P is silent. So civil core. build because I need that which means I also need marble planks <laughs> where's my marble I only have one marble all right guys we're going mining basically we just got to beat the shit out of rocks until we get what we want and every now and again they'll drop some marble um I don't remember if I get marble from the mines or not I don't believe I do, but I don't know. Ah, uh, yes, here's another husband. This is, this is Adit. Oh, you new in town as well? I just moved here a little while ago. Name's Adit. Adit. He's not bad either. He's not too terrible, except not all his voice lines are voice acted. Weird. But who am I to judge? Oh, I need a better god diddly darn pickaxe. All right, let's go grab some commissions because it should be open and fucking Higgins should be done picking whatever fucking job it is that he wants. Unless he's not in there yet. No, he's taken off, so he's already picked whatever the fuck it is that he wants. Fuck Higgins, by the way. Fuck Higgins straight to heck. Um, we're going to grab except that one. I can only take one at a time. Copper pipes. Wooden storages. Take that one. I think for this we have to go up to the second... The second mine. To get the small engines. I can look it up really quick though. Let's see my time up because I don't totally already have the wiki open on my phone from earlier cough cough search my time at Porsche wiki um what was it small engine um abandoned ruins hazardous ruins and a mission obtaining 
Mirren runes one are clearing the first stage of the hazardous runes. So these are available in this one, I believe. So we don't actually have to go to another one. Let's go spelunkin. Let's go quarry the shit out of this. Yeah, this, uh, this mine. Quarry? Qu quarry? You know how sometimes you see words spelled out, but you've never heard them said aloud before? So when you see or hear them read aloud properly, you're like, what the fuck? Is that actually how that's supposed to sound? I'm struggling with quarrying. That's my word that I'm just like, is that real? Is that how that's supposed to be said? I have no clue. Oh my god, that's real close. Got some old parts, but we are on the hunt for a small engine. I'm on the hunt. I'm after you. I have to start using my soft voice. I got a weird glass jar piece. Totally needed that. Rolls my eyes because I don't. Again, I'm not worrying too much about the artifacts until later. Hey, we got a special a special engine. A small engine, aka a special item. Words I can do the words in good, as y'all can tell. Probably could have just gone up and figured this shit out from above, but uh why do things the easy way when I can do things the hard way? Do 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 another engine? What is this? I got some power stone. Um, right there. Eventually I'll also be able to upgrade the glasses so that it'll actually show me what it is I'm digging towards and it won't just be a weird glowing single, sing, single, si what the brain? Symbol or signal? One of the, uh, the one or the other, not both. A weird glowing symbol in the underground. Welcome to the stream, where Sox talks to herself and also simultaneously yells at herself for not being able to words good. Do, do, do. How has your guys' day been? Tell me about it. I want to know. Chat, how are you? Do, do, do. Oh dear, I guess I'll go with that one. That seems to be the closest one to me. <laughs> you're, you're difficult, Thess? Shane is groggy, Thess is difficult. Appreciate it. These are very, very titillating discussion. Cogs is productive. Well, what are you doing, dude? What have you been up to? Also, I'm glad you had the chance to stop by. Ah, your day has been difficult. What's been difficult about it? Tell me. So I can tell you in my low, sultry tone that everything is going to be okay. As you hear obnoxious whacking noises in the background because I'm trying to mine. Oh, I just need another engine. Oh, I guess there's no way but up. I still have quite a bit of stamina and I still have quite a bit of time left in the day. It's not too terrible. A lot of games like this require a lot of time management, which I'm just notoriously bad at. Well, with that tone, I'm sure there are plenty of other obnoxious whacking noises drowning out the chimes. Now, now, I might start to think you like me or something. The or something is in air quotes. We got some copper. That'll be useful for later. Eventually, I'm also going to make a better furnace because the one I'm using right now is just so fucking slow. 
so fucking good. And then I'll make some more wooden storages. Suppose I am pretty difficult too. Like maybe not Mega Man too difficult, but maybe Zelda too difficult. You had to name two of the games that I've just never played. But I will take your word for it that they are hard. Do do do. Oh my god. I just want another small engine, please. And then I can leave. Eh, Zelda 2 isn't hard per se. Is it the water temple in Zelda 2 that's difficult? I say, talking completely out of my ass. Um, I gotta back up. I'm too close to the wall. Oh, right there. I think I can reach it, but I think... Oh my goodness, I did it again. It's just not very straightforward. That's fair. I am a fan of straightforward games where it you don't have to like figure out a bunch of different side quests to get to the main quest. It's all kind of linear in a sense. But I also a fan of games where you just don't even need to do the main quest where you can just go dick around in side quests for an hour and the plot like it's not time sensitive. So you can just keep going and doing whatever you want and eventually you'll get to the big bad at some point. Maybe not today, but like Eventually, you know? Oh? I've never played Mega Man 2 either. I don't think I've ever played any Mega Man game. Mega Man has the same kind of aesthetic style as Astro Boy, right? Okay, I, ha I don't have enough stamina to go find anything else, so we're just going to leave my, my tunnel. My little hole that I've dug into the ground. And I'm going to stretch for a moment while I'm at the loading screen. Oh, it wound up being a lot later than I thought. I mean, the cartoons anime, sort of. Oh, shit, there's a chest here. What's in there? Hey, I got dried apple slices. I'm sure I can use those for something. I mean, probably. Need a better pickaxe. Okay, I get it. Me. And then everything changed in... Wow, those are letters in... Oh my god, my voice just cracked real bad. <laughs> everything changed in... Mega Man 10, I want to say? 10? Yes? No? Maybe? Or is it just Mega Man X? Is X just actually what it's called? Alright, now back to making bronze. And then I need... Do I need bronze pipes or copper pipes? Bronze. It's just called X. It was the 10th installment, but they just named it X. All right, I can only make one, so there's no point. Okay, friends, let's go to sleep. Let's go to Betty Bye. Do, 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 do. Confirm. How has the stream been, by the way? Have I finally gotten over my issues from last time when I was trying to stream Bioshock? Have we been going steady? Wink. Fuel depleted, of course it is. And I don't have any wood. God damn it. Here we go. Let's go fucking deforest. Everything takes so much wood. I think I just need 20 to refuel the furnace. You haven't any, had any issues. I'm glad. And it's still good on Thessa's end. Thessa's been here since the get-go. Since I started streaming at 9 today. 
I know my usual time is 10.30, but I, I finished work early, so I figured, eh, why not? How can you not have wood? You're a natural producer of it. You flatter me. And flattery, good sir, will get you everywhere. Or so I've been told. I'm not quite sure, actually. Do, do, do. I might take a small break in a bit to go get water. But I also don't particularly want to, so we're at a bit of a crossroads. You're just stating facts. Then why am I not on the moon right now? You know what? Because you didn't compliment the right people. That's why you're not on the moon. Okay, let's refuel. There we go. That takes care of that. And I've got a message. Some doll. Oh, okay. Fuck it. We gotta go to the tree farm, guys. Eventually, when I finish the tree farm quest line, I'll be able to just get wood. Like, I'll just wake up and there will be wood delivered to my house. That's every girl's dream, right? And I ran, I ran so far away. Oh my god. Would running in the 90s be better because of her aesthetic? Um? Yes, sir. I see an um. So glad you came. We're at our wit's end here. Maybe. I don't know why, but the fan bats have been coming out of the swamp and into our tree farm since last month. Now they're flying all over the farm, preventing anyone from getting near. Cool. We've tried everything already. Fire, water, cotton candy, you name it. They just won't go away. The Civil Corps came the other day and they're as clueless as us. They've been sucking nutrients and poisoning our trees. Look at them. The leaves are turning brown. <laughs> Every you girl's dream something. statement. Yeah, I figured. We actually talked with Higgins as well. But he's scared of the pan bats. So we can only turn to you now. Can you help us? But you can see it with just this interaction, the difference between Adit and Dawa. Oh, thank you, thank you. But how do you plan on solving? I think I'll go talk with the research center first. They might think of something. Yes, the pan bats. Um, where are they? The panda bats. Oh, look at it. Oh, they are much higher level than me. Gotta go. Gotta run. Gotta run. Nope. <laughs> Not dealing with that problem right now. They're... That's not what he said. They are not fucking the wood dry of its nutrients, sir. You are mistaken. I know, inventory, I'm aware you're full. I'm sorry, I need, I need you to be unfull for a brief moment in time. Honest mistake, I'm sure it was. But uh, his voice gives me Danny DeVito vibes though. I don't know if you guys got that too. But that might just be me wanting Danny DeVito to be in my game. Oh my god, where was I going? What was I doing? Do you remember what I was doing? Because I don't even remember what I was doing. I'm gonna go sell some stuff. This is what happens when I get distracted by quests. I just completely forget everything that's happening and everything that I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, I think that's it, because I need to hold on to that. Oh, wasn't done. There we go. Oh, there's a quest over here. It's a quest, or do I have to ha Oh, no, I hand this in over here. Here we go. No. Thank you. I used to see a bike parked alongside- What? What? Thank you for the tip about the bike. I don't understand why you said you used to see a bike parked along Main Street. It's like gravelly DeVito. Something to stop a pan bat infestation. Um, I'm not sure. Director, do you know anything that might stop a pan bat? Of course, my dear. Pan bats are very sensitive to sound. 
If you make some sort I'm of not digging of either of these voices either. We can cross that. Merlin and right, Petra off the box. husbando Let's slash see. waifu hunting list. Designs. A very straightforward design, but the sound might be kind of noisy, but it'll be easy to make. Or a more complicated Both. the type that wants everything, huh? You have them. Great. Yep. Oh, you came. Since you're building the the problem is they there's a hazardous Yep. Hi. Did you discover something new? Yep. You don't have enough data to God damn it. Hi. Did you discover something new? Uh, that's the data good. Data corruption on these disks are minimal. This chat is far too smutty. Yeah, welcome. It uh it happens. It gets a little inappropriate sometimes, but I don't complain too much. Here we go. Also, if I get distracted, you can just type in all caps. Okay, I am here. I have arrived. Trying your luck with a hazardous ruin? This is a very dangerous mm. area. You'll need to prove yourself worthy. You'll have to last a minute against a local civil corps officer in combat. There are three of us. I have to last a minute. You want to try this now? Let's try this now. I might not be able to last a minute, just because of how how like the level difference between us. I just have to last. I don't actually have to fight her. That's the thing. I don't actually have to win. I just basically run around the edge of the ring for the entirety of the minute. I wouldn't blame Earl. I honestly wouldn't. Ow! Oh god. She hurt me. This is why I have to run around. This is why I can't let her hit me. Because as long as I can last the minute without dying, I'm good. And I'm so close. Whoo, boy. She never said I had to win. She just said I had to last. So I don't care if I lose. Oh, I won? You're pretty good. Good enough that I don't have to worry too much. <laughs> Amazing combat, right? I unlocked a new area by running away. And I got friendship points. But we're also crossing Sam off the waifu list. Just because I don't, I'm not a particular fan of her voice either. One day, one day I'll find the perfect voice for me. I blame Earl too, not for the smutty chat, just generally. Poor Earl. It's blamed for everything, it seems, and it's not his fault. Do do do. That's good. What did I need to upgrade my my thingy? An upgrade kit, so that's all I have to get for that. It's okay, I'm used to being hated by my lessers. It's cause he's Canadian. But see, I'm also Canadian. So does that mean you also blame me for everything? Am I also at fault? I need to know. For science. Alright, I want to go upgrade my pickaxe so I can actually fucking mine some of these rocks so I can get more marble so I can do this goddamn quest. Uh, yes. Oh, good to know. This makes sense. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for my Canadianness. I'm sorry that it has caused you so much trouble. I just blame him because I'm pretty sure he's my doppelganger. I feel like I've seen both of you and I feel like that's partially untrue. You are both your own person and amazing in equal rights. Uh, I can't wait till I get my battle skirt. <laughs> I accidentally bought this because I thought I could wear it and I didn't realize I had to be level 15. But the battle skirt combined with the uniform jacket looks real, real slick. <laughs> Motherfucker, I came first if anything, you're my doppelganger. 
Nah, they look pretty similar to me. I shake my head at both of you. Or all three of you. All three of you here, causing trouble. Distracting me. Which is good, because I need distractions from this goddamn quest. Got some wood. And... I'm an idiot. I no longer can make my pickaxe because I fucking made the other thing I need to make the goddamn skiver. Ugh. There's so much you have to do. I've heard that argument before, but I just don't buy it. <laughs> I was a peaceful boy living in harmony, then everything changed when the Lappy Nation attacked. Pardon me, stranger, but this tree isn't important to your family, right? I can chop down whatever goddamn tree I want. I'm gonna deforest the entirety of this town before I'm through. There will be no trees. And I need to show the tree who is boss. If I don't show it who's boss, it might think of growing back. And I just, I can't have that. I must deforest the land. Hey. There you go. Thief. I'm not stealing. Not necessarily. Nobody's arresting me for it. They actually expect me to cut down all these trees because I'm a builder and I need wood to build. You get it? You dig? Do -do -do. I need to make... I'm just going to make a bunch of wooden surges. So when I actually have to use it, I can. Or not use it. Um, what is the word I'm looking for? Okay, and now... Is that all I needed? I just need the marble board now. Do I have enough to make one? Hey, here we go. Uh, I still have health left, so we're gonna go cut down some big trees. <laughs> you can't own a tree. You stole their tree. It's on their property. It's not on anybody's property. Nobody owns this land. I can buy it at some point, so then they all become my trees, and I will own them. But right now, they're just a future me's property. That past me is borrowing. Oh, is it for the rubber fruit? It is for the rubber fruit. Oh, uh, what can I abandon? Actually, I'll just eat. Doughy. Can you, like, I guess if a tree is on your yard, it becomes your tree. I wouldn't consider that owning a tree. I consider that you just kind of building around where the tree already existed before you. So you can technically own a cat, but they're going to do whatever the fuck they want anyway. <laughs> that be the tree enslaver up in here. That, I would read that sci-fi novel. In the dystopian future, trees are our slaves. So what a unique twist on Lord of the Rings. Where there's a whip, there's a way, my dude. Will whipping trees garner you the results you want, though? It kind of seems like a doomed effort. Do do do. Look at my couch. It's a ripped up couch, but it's mine. Look at it. I can also change its color now, which um I couldn't do before. Oh, I need pigment to do it. I don't think I have pigment. Can I just hit confirm? Nope, I don't have any dye. <laughs> There's unrest in the forest. There's trouble with the trees. For the maples cry oppression from beneath the oaken leaves. I do as I please and please as I do. <laughs> there are planet trees in this game? I don't know. I don't think I can even plant trees in this game. Trees just kind of appear. Take research center. Thank 
here. Got a loudspeaker and a boombox. And I think the boombox is the one I want to actually make. Do do do. Oh, oh shoot. Oh wait. Haha. -ha. Easy solution to this problem. Upgrade my pickaxe. Nice. There we go. Figured it out, boys. Now I've got a skiver. Um, put that there. Can I just make tires? Is that a thing I can just do? Or do I have to upgrade my work table? Oh, I have to upgrade my work table. Let's go see what it's going to take to upgrade my work table so I can make... Um, what's it called? Go blare your love by the outfield at them. They're pam bats. That's basically what you do, though. That's how you... I guess, fix the problem? Wait, what is today? Today's 18th. So we're still good. Tomorrow's the festival that we um, found out at the beginning of the stream. Fuck you, Higgins. Here we go. Uh, six glasses. Mm, yep. Because it's Phyllis, and I don't want this fucker anywhere near the goddess Phyllis. And then here's Antoine. Dr. Zoo, my idol. Every time I think of him, my heart flutters. This boy should not be seducible by female characters. In my opinion. And I will leave it at that. <laughs> you know, I like my girls a little bit older. I know there's a cover of uh, Your Love on one of the Pop Goes Punk albums that I really enjoyed, and I can't remember who sings it. Ooh, who sings it? He could be. He could be. But aesthetically, I find it very difficult. If you're an engineer, he'd be an engi-queer. Not bad. We can make some fiber. Fiber cloth, which I actually need a fuck ton of, so... Craft the shit out of that. Let's grab that out. No, I need that. I think that's all I can put in there for right now. I need another one for before I can do that, so I think I'm just gonna put that back in there. We'll take those out. I'll put those away. My work just called me at 10.30 at night? The fuck? They shouldn't be at the mall. I will cross that bridge when I come to it. Ninja Party did a cover of it too. I don't think I've heard the Ninja, Ninja Sex Party version of it. Starting to have some pausing issues again, but that might be me roommate is playing rest um it doesn't look like it's on my end it looks like i'm holding pretty steady i've been keeping an eye on how many frames get dropped because ideally zero percent is what you want but zero percent is not what i'm sitting at um what was i doing i was doing something let's see what do I need to make a better furnace? I need nine marble, 15 bronze bar, and two stone stools. I'll start that, because I need it. I need it real bad. You have it a bit too, and you've got it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, dear. What was I doing? Your mom. Thank you. I appreciate you answering my question so honestly and openly. I am on Wi-Fi. The hardline doesn't run to my room, otherwise I would be hardline. I'm gonna take a picture of that real quick so I can reference it later. So I can... Oh, not that. What do I want to do? This is the one. 
Do do do. Just so I know how much marble and how much bronze I need. So this is gonna this is gonna take a long, long while. For shame, Lappy is suck a dick. There will be no dick sucking in my chat. I will not allow it. Uh, Alright. So to get the amount of marble I need, I need nine. Don't threaten me with a good time. I... okay. I will no longer threaten you with good times. There will be no fun times had in this chat. They have been banned. I'm sorry. You all must go home. <laughs> There's no dick sucking that I'm out. Now you're following. Oh hey, Lappy! Thanks for following. I appreciate it. Maybe I'll allow some dick sucking. Just a little though, not too much. Do do do. There hasn't been a fun time since I started watching the screen. Ouch. I'm so sorry that my crafting adventures have disappointed you. What do you want me to do? Do you want me to go fight someone? I can go fight someone. That's fun, right? I can go kick somebody's ass. As long as I'm lower level than them. Anyway. Okay, I'm good on that. Gonna chop down a tree real quick. My heart hurts though. That's because your idea of fun is dying cold and alone. I mean, I can also do nothing. I can just kind of stand here, watch this town suffer and die. That's always an option. But it's like siding with the bad guys in Stardew. It just, it's not a good victory. Do, do, do. Let's see. Let's we'll have some romanceable options. Let's go over those. Because we are supposed to be husbando hunting. Um, Petra is an option. I don't know any of her preferences. What are her perks? Wife, a chance at receiving gifts first thing in the morning. Not worth it. I was told that this was a stream by a girl. That means tits. All girl streamers use their big American titties to enhance the gameplay. Additionally, lots of, lots of lag. Kiss. Friend. Gives gifts sometimes. Wife. Receives help with domestic work and resource gathering. Will also receive a 25% discount at Emily's food stall. Do, do, do. Relationship perk. Oh my god. Being her friend has a lot of benefits. Friend, add an extra 5% to resilience. Or buddy, add an extra 5% to resilience. Friend, add an extra 5% to resilience. Lover, add an extra 10% to resilience. Wife, a chance at receiving gifts first thing in the morning. So far, Emily's looking like the strongest candidate, but again, I'm looking for the best voice in this game. Uh, he gives defense points and a chance of everything. They'll just give me presents. And I guess that's okay. Friend gives gifts sometimes. Husband, a chance at receiving gifts in the morning. Albert. 10% less materials needed for homestead upgrades. Husband, a chance at receiving gifts first thing in the morning. Well, I guess I can't. Romance. Dawa. That's fine, though. Dr. Zoo. 10% discount when consuming in the store. Send gifts through the mail sometimes. Boyfriend, add an extra 100 health points and 10% off in the store. Lover, receive a 25% discount when consuming in the store. Husband, receive help with domestic work and resource gathering and a chance of receiving gifts first thing in the morning. So Dr. Zoo is also looking like a strong candidate. Um, 10% discount, sends gifts, discount, discount, helps. Nora's also looking pretty strong. She's got a lot of perks. Carol, I can't do anything with. 
discount, sends gifts, discount, discount, and gifts. Hello. Attack points. I like Arlo as well. <laughs> he doesn't have any perks until you marry him. That's not particularly what I want. They are. Some of them only have like one buff and I'm just like, okay. Uh, discount, gifts, discount, discount. Alice is also looking pretty strong. Buddy, stay in your home. Treat you as her family. Pinky is my favorite. Pinky is the true waifu. Buddy, friend. You get more money if I go with Antoine, but I feel it's just kind of morally wrong. She gives me more. Phyllis gives me more stamina. Why am I not surprised? Um, Merlin. Sends gifts sometimes. Gust. Ooh, he's also looking really good. <laughs> we'll not check on Ginger anymore when she's on a date with you. Thank you. Is Dr. Zoo obligated to remind you that he's not actually a licensed medical... Medical professional? I don't know. I don't know if he's actually a licensed medical professional or not. I can marry the teacher? Not enough perks, Lucy. Toddy. Not enough perks, Toddy. And then Higgins, who's just my nemesis and I will not want anything to do with. Um, Adit. Chance at receiving gifts in the morning. Then I still haven't met a bunch of these people, which is okay. I don't need to meet everybody. It's not necessary. I forgot what I was supposed to be doing again. Do do do. And then I still need 15 bronze bars. And I have three. So that's going to take a while. We're going to go off and do something else until that's done. Um, I needed to make glass, though. How long do I have before that commission runs out? Four days. I think I can get it done in four days. I think. Maybe. I'm having some doubts. But don't worry, they're not like doubt doubts. They're just kind of partial doubts. Um, I might just have to cancel this for now. And then retrieve that, cancel that, and then make some glass. Remember to donate to Lappy's new laptop fund. Oh, Lappy. I would donate to your fund. Don't worry. I also am not reminding people to donate to the Get Socks More Ram Fund because I don't want anybody to feel obligated to do it. A little bit of help would go a long way, but again, it's just not my highest priority. If that was a reference to Doctor Z, I don't think she's played Borderlands. I have not played Borderlands yet, Cogs. You know this. Your character leans so hard forward when she runs. She does, doesn't she? She like she like touches the, her face touches the ground when she runs. Uh, let's stamina build up a little. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. Um. I appreciate the sentiment, but Canadian money isn't real. It's real, it's just the dollar really sucks compared to yours. Our dollar is brutally low. We are very rarely ever on par with our American friends. Do, 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 do. That's all I can put in there. Um, I might put down another wooden storage just to hold the resources. So I can put some of this stuff down. 
that won't need it until a bit later. I can actually grab the hardwood, the regular wood. Um, I think that's it for now, because everything else just needs to get made anyway. Doot, 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 doot. No, that's all I can put in there. I'm not going to put the storage in there then. I'll put the hardwood planks in there. Borderlands is terrible. You're terrible. Borderlands is decent, but generally really save me after a while. <laughs> I'm confused. Are we still talking about the dollar? Oh, I need die to do this. F that. Grabbing all that wood. I need it. I need the wood. Can't do much without wood. I'm just kind of lost. I don't know what to do. I need the glass to finish. I need this stuff to finish. I'm gonna go cut down more trees. I'm gonna go deforest more Porsche just because I know I'm gonna need it at some point. Deforest the land for my own gain. Eventually the trees grow back at like the same size after a few days, which is really confusing. You figured it would go through stages. Hey. It's in that, it's not voice acted. I, it's an early access game, so I'm not too concerned. I have faith that eventually all the lines will be voice acted and some of the characters will have better perks and storylines. I should have prefaced with that this, hey, this is an early access game. I'm playing it before it's technically finished. So I have... I have faith that there will be improvements along the way, and that everything that I have grapes with may or may not get uh, solved. Yeah, if you have nothing to do, collecting resources seems to be the name of the game. I agree. I'm just flummoxed. Um, I'm gonna kick this tree. And I'm gonna kick it again. And keep kicking this tree until it gives me the good stuff. Since you seem underleveled to do some of your quests. Getting swole wouldn't be a bad idea either. That's true. Let's punch some shit. Um, we can go punch some llamas in the meantime. Eventually we're going to have to go fight a big bad in the cave across the way. But I don't think we're allowed in there just yet. Hey, Oaks. Actually, can I give you something? No, never mind. I changed my mind. I don't want to give you anything. Get away from me. Don't touch me. Uh, I remember back in the day. I remember back in the day when people released games when they were done. I think it's kind of interesting to have a game where crafting is the goal rather than the means. Yeah. It's definitely different compared to like the other farming style games I've played. Which is nice, but also just like, until you get to a point where you have better equipment, it takes so long and it's so tedious. But, I wonder if there's a game mode and I just have this on Oh, there's no, there's no ability to change like the game mode or anything. That's not terrible. I can change the voiceover to something else. <gasps> I can change the voiceover to Chinese. I have a temptation. Chat. Chat. Do I change the voiceover to Chinese just for shits and giggles? Or do I leave it at English? I need to know your opinion. Do what you think is best. That's a dumb answer. That is a cop-out of an answer if I have ever heard one. Oh, you do you. God damn it. You guys are useless. Do you listening to it in Chinese? So fuck you, Lappy. You didn't answer in time. I was already angry. Where's Bear Boy? Did he take off? Yeah, he took off. 
Do do do. Oh, can I harvest this shit now? Hey, cool. I got the more wheat. Glass is still going. I just need to make sure that this is constantly fueled. My little couch in the corner. Oh, I love it. My house is so just kind of empty and naked. I have no furniture. Here we go. We don't. Fill this real quick. Ooh, I have a letter. What does it say? Today is the day of the bright sun. Oh shit, that's right. Okay, I gotta put down another wooden storage box. I'm just for my miscellaneous shenanigans. Um, yeah, I think after the festival, I'm going to chill out and uh, call it quits for this stream. We've been going for quite a while. And by quite a while, I mean almost two hours. And I think the longest I tend to go for is about an hour and a half-ish, give or take. So this is a little bit longer than usual, but I also started a little bit earlier than I usually do. All right, we'll do the festival and then we'll come back. <laughs> Here we go. All right, I guess we can talk to some people over here. <laughs> I have some regrets. I'm going to change it back to English now. <laughs> I lasted so long. There we go. Um... This is Django. How do you sound? My sofa disappeared. What the okay. You don't have fully voice acted lines yet. Oh, the house seems to have been broken in by a thief. It is none of your business. Uh, thanks, Elliot. Or fucking Elliot. That's Stardew Valley. Thanks, Gust. The civil cause are responsible for collecting power stones to power culture. Oh, Arlo. We also try to ensure the safety of all the people living here. Oh, Arlo, you are a strong contender for Husbando. Hey, Oaks. Papa Bear gets agitated quite often during summer due to his thick fur. Oh I my need to figure god. Out a way to okay, again, just the difference in quality is very jarring to me. Happy brightness, everybody. It's been a hundred... It's been a hundred years since Peach brought back our son. It's impossible f uh, fuck. So let's have fun today, but let us also remember- remember- Oh my god. Some of the grammar. Also, uh, Armstrong's in this game if you watch Full Metal Alchemist. Except his name is Polly and he dyed his hair for some reason? Happy brightness, everyone. Okay, and now the fun- fun begins. You see that? That up there? It's gonna start dropping presents. We gotta run around and collect them all. Yes, okay. Hello. Can we... Can we get going, sir? Oh no, not that. I don't know what... Why is that there? Stop it. That is the one that's gonna start dropping gifts. Which I am really, really excited for. As you can see. And uh, the townsfolk will all grab one, so eventually you're just gonna have to like run and just just go nuts, just grab as many as possible. So there are children in this game. Not a fan of them. Wait a second. Wait a second. Here we go. The celebration has started. Let the chaos begin. Oh god damn it. Toby, you fuck! You put a rock in here. Ah! God damn it! I need to like be ahead of everybody. This is very difficult. Fuck you, Phyllis. Like scatter. 
I'm not very good at this game. All I got was a rock, Charlie Brown. Too much for stream. Okay. Give me your gifts, aeroplane. Drop them somewhere away from these fucks. I want something more than a rock. Oh my god. It's like, the only mechanic I don't like this is that they grab things faster than you do. So by the time I get to hit E, somebody else has already grabbed it. Is that it? Is that everything? I, mm, mm -hmm. I was pressing you. Oh my god. I'm very bad at this game. I'm sorry, guys. I have to, like, stop running for me to be able to press it. But if I stop running, like... And I got a soap. Okay, I got something. I got something other than a rock. That's all I really care about. Do do do. I think that's it. I don't know if it's gonna keep going out there or not, though. I'm gonna grab this chest. See what I mean? They just. <sighs> This is too chaotic, but I guess that's the point. Is that it? No more presents? Do you have any more gifts? I'm staring directly up my ass and like the rest of my body is just gone. Now I guess that's it. That was fun. I got rock and soap. Higgins. There's a chest over here, though, that nobody else seemed to give a shit about, so I'm just gonna sneak over here, and I'm just gonna... I got some apricot juice. Oh, we still have some time, so I can still go gather some resources, if I really wanted to. This could definitely use some refinement before release. <laughs> yeah. It's... <sighs> Trying to look up and see where the presents fall and also being able to run and grab them before anybody else does, it's... Uh... You want mini games to be difficult, but not too difficult. Because if they're too difficult, people get frustrated and they're like, I don't, I don't want anything to do with this anymore. I'm done. I'm over it. This is all my random shenanigans. Just be wary. Have several people. I guess I, early release is also a way of playtesting the game before it gets released to the public. But I also find a lot of the time early release games don't particularly get everything really gets fixed before they go live. Um, sometimes things just get kind of swept under the rug. And you find out later. So I, I hope that in an upcoming patch they'll make some adjustments to these mini games, make them a little bit easier. Cause also the date games and the like the play date games are all they should have little parachutes. Oh, that would be cute. Make them slow fall so you can like grab them out of the air. That'd be cool. I'd be okay with that. That'd make it significantly more enjoyable for me. What is the point of this? Area leads me to nowhere. I'm trying to get to Phyllis, and I can't. I've gone and confused myself again. And shadows where they land. That one, I might. I might also have to make it so the townspeople don't have zero reaction time, right? Because like I have to. 
I have to stop running and also press E, but by the time I do, there's just a swarm of them. They're just all there. There's no opportunity for me to grab them other than pure dumb luck. Ah. Here we go. Let's go see Phyllis. Let's go see one of the loves of my life. Hi, Sam. Can you guys who weren't here earlier see why I enjoy Phyllis? Can you, do you maybe have an inkling of a guess as to why Phyllis is one of my favorite characters? Could you possibly be able to see at any point why Phyllis is my favorite? Also, maybe. <laughs> Sorry, I was in that zone. Maybe you give Phyllis illness, some flavor lines. Come to the clinic. Because so far, this is all she's been saying, and I don't know if once I have better relationship with her, her dialogue will get a little bit spicier, or just you know, any differentiation. But uh, we'll see. All right, and then no fall damage. Here we go. Ooh, there's a chest back here. I also like these this loot chests just sprinkled around the game. It makes it fun. And that I can go on like a scavenger hunt to find all the chests in the in the town. And figure out how to get to them. Got a bloodstone. The philosopher's stone? Wee! I can think of two good reasons, right? You know what I'm talking about, boys. You, you, you're picking up on what I'm putting down. Oink. Onward. Alright. I'm gonna go put some of this stuff away in my nonsense chest. Put that stuff away for sure. Uh, I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna cancel making this glass. And I'm gonna go have it go back to making bronze bars. Just because I need so fucking many. And on that note, my loves, I will have to bid you adieu. The chat lag, yeah, it's gotten pretty bad. I have a setting, so I might have to go and readjust some things again. Um, but I have a setting that, uh, that I might have to change that I can't remember the name of right now. But I do, I would like to thank you all for coming and hanging out on this Thursday stream. Um, Thursdays and Saturdays, I tend to stream on my own. Tuesdays are Nuzlocke, so they will all, <laughs> so they will always have somebody else with me. Um, but yeah, my darlings, it's time for me to say goodbye and good night. And I appreciate that all of you come, have come to watch me stream, and I hope you come to watch, uh, watch me stream again. I will see you later.